Hey guys, it's Andy here. In this video, I'm going to show you how I made this interesting layered sculpture from a few decks of cards. So this idea was a product of me attempting to make a layered landscape sculpture. Either way, I ended up making this, and I think it's somewhat interesting, so yeah. Let's do it! To make this, I used a handy craft knife, a pencil, a PVA glue stick, a long Lego section to help me draw straight lines, and of course two packs of playing cards, one red and one blue. Using the Lego piece, I lined it up with the line at the edge of the card and drew out a right angle L shape. I then took the craft knife, cutting out the inside of the card and the outside of the L section. There we go. If you're not very good at cutting straight lines, like me, you can always use a grinding stone or some sandpaper to smoothen them out. I placed a red card behind the first cutout and decided where I wanted the lines to go. This time I drew two lines crossing over each other in a kind of crossword shape. I didn't use any specific measurements for the lines and basically created them as completely random right angles each time. I then repeated this process over and over again with various different right angled lines. Once the inner space began to fill up, it kind of looked remnant to a Windows 95 screensaver. I decided 15 different cutouts was enough to fill up the space, and then moved on to cutting out the spacer cards for in between. I simply cut out the pattern section from the inside, leaving the outside remaining. Altogether, I cut out 30 spacer cards. Now, it's just a matter of sticking them all together. I stuck two spacer cards in between each design and simply layered the cutouts, one after the other, each being the opposite colour. Once the last layer was added, I stuck a blue card to the back. And now it's finished. So there we have it, an interesting layered sculpture made from playing cards. I think if you were skilled with a craft knife, unlike me, you could actually make this into a very kind of delicate and detailed scene that would look really interesting. Thanks for checking out this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and stay notified. I've left the links to my Instagram, Facebook and Etsy shop down below, so don't forget to check them out. And um, yeah, that's everything. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.